Hello, and welcome to part 2 of making Breakout in Scratch. Let's get started. Okay, so first we'll go to the Brick Sprite. And when we start as clone, we'll repeat forever. If touching ball, then... Well, let's change Brick to Life by minus 1 and delete this clone. There we go. And now the bricks should properly break when touching the ball. And they do. Now if you look at our bricks alive variable, it's properly counting the bricks remaining on screen. Okay, now that's working. Now let's go to our ball sprites and if Y position is smaller than 100 minus 170 and bricks alive is bigger than zero um, we'll broadcast something called you lose just like that and we'll hide this sprite and we'll stop this script now let's make a new sprite called win slash lose okay now the first costume will be named you win and we'll just write you win in white letters and maybe outline it so it'll be a bit thicker um, yes I think that's good now let's duplicate this costume and name it you lose and just change the change the text to you lose Okay, now let's go to the code, and when we receive start, we're going to stop other scripts in the sprites, and we're going to hide ourselves. And then we're going to one wait one second, and then we're going to repeat forever, if bricks alive equals zero. That means we've destroyed all the blocks. We're going to change costume to you win and going to position ourselves to x0, zero, y0. Zero. Actually, let's do that before the forever loop. Okay, now let's repeat three times. Hide and um, wait. 0 0.5 seconds and show and wait 0 0.5 seconds and then we're going to wait 2 seconds then we're going to broadcast start okay now let's duplicate this code and change it to when I receive you lose we're going to Let's take out the wait one second and the forever loop. Yeah, like that. And we're just going to change our costume to you lose. And that should work. Now let's go to our ball sprite and show when we receive start. And let's change the point in direction to minus 89 to 89. I made that mistake in the last episode. And there we go. Here is our finished breakout game. And I am going to make another video about improving this project. But until then, goodbye.